You know, one of the amazing stories for us is the very first patient that I ever flew in 2010 was the name of Antonio. She'd been uh, in uh, labor for three days, was unconscious. We got a call Good Friday. It was the first patient ever. Still remember putting the stretcher in the airplane, loading her in. Uh, the weather was kind of cloudy, rainy. Uh, 35 minutes seemed like forever. And I remember looking at her as she's a foot or two away from me waiting to see if uh, her chest was still moving, that she was still alive. And we got her in. Uh, she ended up uh, having this baby boy. We, we had a chance to, to minister to her and uh, her, her husband, her other daughter, and uh, this little baby boy. And the cool thing was uh, they ended up giving him uh, my name, uh, which is Mark. And so we've had this baby Mark, and some of you have probably heard this story uh, for many years. Well, this last April, I had a chance to be uh, in New Guinea. Uh, with my wife Kirsten and we landed on the on the river next to Antonio's village and uh, she came paddling out to the airplane and I just she saw me and tears streaming down her face uh, Kirsten and I had a chance to give her a hug and catch up with her and um, you know just to hear that she just became a grandma in the last couple months and uh, and then I asked her How, how's Mark doing and you know Mark is now 14 years old and she says you know he's at boarding school living with his aunt who's a teacher and doing really well and uh, had a chance to talk to his aunt. I know just a reminder of God's faithfulness and, and this little baby, baby Mark, who's now 14 years old and to see uh, Antonio now a grandma uh, and these two lives that were saved that transformed their family and then a chance to share a clear gospel message with them. Uh, and that's really what Samaritan Aviation is all about. And it's so great to be back, to see the impact that we're making all of these years later now having three airplanes in the country, a fourth airplane here in the U.S. that it's getting ready to go over. And we're so excited to, to just see how God continues to grow the organization. Uh, our flights are up 40% last year. Uh, lives are saved, lives are being changed. And uh, we're just so grateful to be part of what's going on in Papua New Guinea. Saving lives and offering access and hope. That's what Samaritan Aviation does. And uh, we're so excited for this year and the future.